This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Jennifer Griswold with 3 News Now and here's a look at what's happening now. The flooding has led to more road closures close to the Missouri-Iowa state line. U.S. Highway 159 east of Rulo is now closed on the Nebraska side of the Missouri River Bridge. The Missouri Department of Transportation reported six feet of water affecting the roads at Big Lake. I-680 and I-29 near Crescent remain closed as the river continues to recede. No timeline yet on when those will reopen. Officials remind drivers not to go around barricades. The Omaha Police Department will celebrate the opening of the West Precinct on Tuesday as the city continues to grow out west. This new facility at 206th and Cumberland Drive will improve police coverage in that area. OPD says having more officers in West Omaha will enhance call response times. A ribbon cutting will be held Tuesday morning. I'm Free News Now Chief Meteorologist Jennifer Zeppelin with this latest weather update. We do have a potential for some severe storms popping up as we head to the evening hours. Really after about 6, 7 o'clock, there could be an intense line of thunderstorms in advance of a cold front moving in. And we're expecting the highest threat to be between Omaha, Tacoma, Denison and Atlantic. Strong gusty winds, probably in excess of 60 miles an hour, some heavy rainfall in some of those areas that get the heaviest downpours and also some small hail would be the biggest concerns that we could see in the evening hours. This is a fast moving storm system. Now before it moves in, strong gusty winds from the south, 20 to 30 miles an hour. That's going to push us up to 86 in the afternoon. So a lot of heating taking place with those winds around. They do finally ease up once the front passes through. Most of this coming to an end after 10 o'clock in the evening. Gorgeous day on Wednesday, low humidity, less wind. It's my pick of the week Thursday. A few more clouds around in 77. We're back up to uh, at least a little bit chance for some hit and miss showers on Friday, about a 30% chance. We're going to keep that around for Saturday and Sunday. We do cool things off a little bit more here, back to about 75 on Friday, 72 on Saturday. If you do have plans to head down to Lincoln for the Huskers game, again, it's an evening game, expecting that there could be some showers around. Hopefully it's out of here before the game gets underway, especially since it's a game day for us and we're looking at 83 on Sunday a little higher chance we could see some isolated storms popping up over the area. Want something spicy? Sliced jalapeno peppers, cream cheese, beef, bacon and real cheddar and mozzarella cheese. It's my jalapeno papa pie. Add a one topping pizza and cinnamon monkey bread for a real feast. Godfather's Pizza. Do it.